You get what, boy? You get that you're a dead man walking? Is that what you get? Leave him alone. Shouldn't you be running for homecoming queen or something? I'm safe standing here, right? I mean, you're not gonna shoot me, are you? The gold hog. But even then, it's not so much words, just a bunch of oohs and ahs, you know? So it's big, huh? Legendary. I mean, if it's as big as you say, I'll be your girlfriend. We could go to prom together. I'll tell you what. We'll call it a draw. Maybe, come on. It's too late for that. Here's the deal. Leave that kid at school alone for a week, and I'll make sure your boys walk. You know what your little joke cost me? Well, I'm pretty sure you won't be getting your bong back. The only vandalism that happens in this town goes through me. Listen, man, I don't have a problem with you. That's where you're wrong. You say you're sorry. Robo Lamb. Said, say you're sorry. Kid Eli Navarro. What do they call him? Weevil. Oh, clearly it's Weevil. Lamb could have set Weevil up. He hates him, you know. He just helped me out of a jam recently, that's all. The trouble with befriending the leader of a motorcycle gang is that, at the end of the day, he's still the leader of a motorcycle gang. And as much as I'd like to believe differently, I doubt it's his grandmother who's buying video games and paying for new motorcycle paint jobs. Following up on a few things for the lawyer who's representing your grandma. He says I should confess. You think you will? Your grandma's in jail. Oh, are you reminding me? Because I almost forgot. I'm just saying, with your reputation, you can't blame McCormick for thinking that... My reputation? I guess what everybody says about you is true, too, huh? Push comes to shove, you're still one of them. You still think like one of them. Take off. I don't want you around me. How can a guy who, according to these records, was in auto shop seven of the eight days his purchases were made, manage to make online orders? Aren't you supposed to be trying to prove he did it? So you can get his grandma out of jail? I don't think he did it. Who didn't do what? Weevil. Listen, I was looking through the attendance records at school, and I just don't think it's possible. Yeah? Cliff just got back from the courthouse. They released Letty Navarro a couple hours ago. That's great. They released her because Eli Weevil Navarro came in and confessed to the crime. Eli is still 17. Charlo is 18, and he's got a record. They'd send him to prison. Weevil can do four months of duty. Weevil thinks he's taking the fall for you. <laughs> oh, I submit to him. Veronica Mars, I hear you're the thank for this Kodak moment. Didn't you get the memo? The bad guy was already in jail. <laughs> Give me some love. You get lonely out here, remember. We will love you long time. My uncle has a body shop on the highway. If you come in, you know, to make sure your body gets the full service treatment. Okay, now you apologize. I'm sorry. Was that too dirty? Not Cause... to me, Dork. To him. This is Veronica. She's the girl who got me out of juvie. I told you about it. Stay away. I'm not the one she's running away from. You okay? Thanks for coming back. Wait, wait, wait. What? You're dating Logan again? After the way he treated Lily? This is news? How many get out of jail free cars do you have if you sleeve anyway? Pretty sure that was my last. So you might keep your felonies to abandon them. What I am, B. Leopard spots, you know what they say. Will you stop for two seconds? See, when they run away like that, it's kind of a hint they're not interested. You do not want to start with me today, Paco. Are you sure? It was in my day plan or under goal. How is this your business? Well, I'm just looking out for Veronica. You helped me out in the past. I'm just returning the favor. Let's say you call it even. Why don't you excuse us, Betty? You waiting to recap my concerned dad lectures? With scissors, no candy for strangers, no smartening up the local criminal element. I always knew you had a thing for me, but I never thought you wanted me for my brain. I'm gagging on the inside. Please tell me you know where Mario lives, because we need to get that pinata right away. Maybe I'll buy you a pinata. You used me. Yeah, well, we're always owing each other favors, aren't we? Don't give me that look. See? There you go with that head tilt. You think you're all badass, but whenever you need something, it's all, hey. I'm feeling the calculating stare, but where's the villainous hand ringing and maniacal laugh? You know, you should be nicer to me. Is it your undying love for me or just good old-fashioned lust that kept you from turning me in? Love, how are you, evil? I haven't seen you. Since that uh, awkward arrested for murder incident? Yeah, I remember. You are under arrest in connection with the murder of Eduardo Orozco. No, man. 
I bet you'd be pretty psyched if I found someone who could help. Eli Navarro. Remember? You mean Weevil? Didn't he get busted for murder? Assault. If he's not employed by his next meeting, he goes back to jail. You know anybody else was hiring ex-cons because... Wish I did. Where's Lily's necklace? Someone left a bracelet in my bed last week. It's a nice necklace. It's Lily's, right? Where's my necklace? I don't have it. It was a frame job, V. You just asked me about Lily's necklace. I can't believe you think I'd do that. To you. You lied to me. What, are you working for the Fitzpatricks now? Is that it? Lied? <laughs> I'd be dead before I worked for those minks. Fine. Whatever. Sell out, then! It must be nice to have choices, Veronica. We can't all be like you. Practically perfect in every way. Sure you can. It's easy. First, stop working on behalf of the richest asshole in Neptune in a plot to drive you and your people out of town. I don't live on Cherry Tree Lane, V. I needed the money. Does that make me a criminal? No, being a criminal makes you a criminal. After all we've been through. Oh, she. Got some weird pistol with my brother. I saw Eli's blonde crush at the motel today. What, what blonde crush? Veronica Mars. Love her to death. You had a wife and a daughter and a legit business and you pissed it all away. I got shot, Veronica. Some rich white lady shot me and I got arrested! That was shitty. And I was there for you. And so was my dad and so was Cliff. What's wrong with you? Veronica Mars. I told you so, I'm gonna be hearing from her. Oh, you don't have to worry about her much longer. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. Do not lie to me. Why am I not gonna have to worry about Veronica? Or me? We were close, once. If there's anything left, there's not. I was the dog, and you were the light.